Hello, lovely souls. Blessings to you and your loved ones. This is a brief oracle advice for midweek. And let's see what are the uh, um, energies and the words of advice for you. I'm going to begin with magical words for you in this moment. Hope you're having a great week. Hope you are actually taking time for yourself as well. Okay, the first one already dropped. And it says it's a two. Um, two choices, um, a moment that you have to choose, whether it's a thought in terms of uh, proposals or actually contracts, uh, connecting with others or new plans and goals, right? And uh, it's something that has to do with a decision in terms probably of legal courts or with some air signs, Libra, Aquarius, or Geminis. It could be just any anyone. So it says here, creativity, energy, and calmness. Creativity, energy, and calmness is here for you, telling you to engage into your moment, to create your space of mindfulness and also awareness that you are allowed to... Um, to have your time of your own, to enjoy this moment. What is the advice in general? What is your advice in general for this moment? What is your advice in general for this moment? And it says, well, the card number 12, which it turns out to be three. And it says connecting with others. Number three is important. Connecting with others, socially gatherings also. I would say that also chatting. It's important to go out. I would say that it does connect with the creativity, energy, and calmness. Creating a space where you can actually connect with others that will make you feel that you are not just uh, on, this, on the same routine and allowing you to and enjoy your moment and actually do different things that you like connect with special people it also has to do with others talking as well you could actually um be in the in the spotlight <laughs> i would say or people trying to know about you and you don't really know who is it you see who is talking about you and this is the energy that's talking about you or is probably having you in their mind that they want to know about you it's the card 28 which it turns out to be a 10 something that probably ended up with a very masculine very charming very sensual energy here it ended up it could be possibly with a friend or someone but it's someone that it's very passionate and has a lot of attraction for you. Or you could be this person as well. And the last one. It says, well, definitely. It, this is the card 25, which is a number 7. But it's actually the, the ring. Someone who, there's a proposal, talking to someone about um, a commitment, something very important. You are important to this person or you've been. And uh, that's what's coming for you. It's very special. Good connection. 